Hello, everyone. My name is Saumya Moni. I'm representing Inkture uh, on the topic extending digital applications with Event Mesh. Uh, I have a co speaker with me for this particular topic, and that's Vandana, who's also there in the call today. Looking forward to this session. Um, we'll start with uh, a bit about the abstract that we submitted for the event, uh, talking about Event Mesh capabilities and um, some of the success stories that we've had using this capability. Uh, we'll do an Inkture overview. Uh, we'll talk about what Event Mesh is and what the possibilities may be uh, for us, as well as uh, conclude this with a case study where we've implemented Event Mesh successfully and arrived at a business impact for our leading customer. A little bit about Event Mesh. Uh, we've uh, actually implemented this application. Um, it's called the Integrated Operations Platform for a leading oil and gas company in the US. Uh, this acts as a centralized cockpit where the company staff was able to manage their operations, gain some real time visibility by harmonizing some of the system landscape that they had uh, with the SAP event mesh capability. And this is available on the SAP business technology platform. Uh, it provides the cloud-based messaging service, uh, which helps in resilience in communication and collaboration of all messages that happen across the platform. I'd like to briefly introduce myself my name is Saumya Mooney. I have about 23 years of experience in product management and marketing. I currently lead marketing and alliances for Incha. I'd also like to introduce my co-speaker, Vandana Dogra. She has 17 years of industry experience in leading large-scale mission-critical applications and programs across several leading enterprises. She currently leads the integration practice and our SME on Event Mesh. A little bit about Incture. Um, Incture is a leading digital applications and digital engineering solutions company headquartered in Bangalore. We've got presence um, across the globe. Uh, we have digital delivery centers in India across five locations and uh, four countries actually. Uh, we have a digital design and development center based out of the US, Mexico, Europe, Middle East and Southeast Asia. Uh, we are proud partners uh, with hyperscale vendors like SAP, Microsoft, AWS. Uh, you can see some of our marquee customers here. Uh, we've got a good um, sort of customer footprint across different geographies that we represent. Um, our employee strength is 900 plus. Uh, we won several innovation awards. Um, consecutively, actually, in the year 2019 and 2020, uh, around SAP business technology platform and executing innovative products and projects on this platform. Uh, we're also recognized as a technology fast 50 uh, winner in Deloitte. A little bit about uh, what we do as part of our portfolio. Our portfolio uh, comprises two areas. Uh, it's called Cherry Work, which is a comprehensive suite of digital applications that we develop on SAP uh, business technology platform. And these applications extend the possibilities of the platform and help our enterprise customers elevate and activate their digital adoption journey. We also have a suite of digital solutions and these solutions and managed services are helping enterprises become intelligent with business transformation. What is our key value proposition that uh, we provide to our customers? And we've typically seen this for most of our customers who are looking to start their digital journey. Uh, we address certain white spaces and niche requirements that the industry or the enterprises may demand. And uh, so therefore we build these applications which are flexible and agile and build for change. We also help initiate the adoption journey uh, for digital from many of the enterprises from on-prem to cloud. We're also in the process of uh, you know, digitization or digitalization. We also engage the workforce of our customers in eliminating any manual or repetitive tasks. And this we do with several services that we use out of 
SAP Business Technology Platform or many of the cloud uh, adoption services that we provide. We also provide end user experience with unified digital workplace. And we do that using several of our unified digital workplace solutions and applications. And this engages the customer in building a greater value for their platform investments, as well as reducing their total cost of investment. A little bit about Cherry work. Uh, as I mentioned before, uh, our customers realize the rapid time to value uh, because of the engaging digital experience that we are able to provide them. And also our applications have inbuilt intelligence, uh, which allows them to actually make quick actions and decisions. Uh, you can find out more about these applications by visiting our website, um, incture.com. A little bit about the advantage that we provide uh, most of these digital applications and what uh, Vandana would be talking about also leverage some of the BTP or business technology platform application uh, services, event mesh being one of them. Um, and since these are out of box prepackaged applications um, and are tailored for the organization, intelligent automation and insights to action are already built in them while they keep the digital core clean. Um, now I will hand over to my co-speaker Vandana to talk about Event Mesh. Yeah, hi everyone, this is Vandana here. Swami has already introduced me, so I'll uh, get into the topic. Uh, so we start with why Event Mesh. So if you look at this uh, diagram on the left side, here we have a scenario where there is core ERP and several other solutions and systems and in-house developed application and a few legacy ones too. And uh, they all need to exchange data in different uh, levels and requirements. So the um, architecture strategy uh, on the right side is around the event messaging. And uh, this is mainly to decouple the communication between uh, these applications, services, and systems and let them talk to a central message broker. So they only need to learn how to integrate to this main service. So SAP Event Mesh is a cloud-based capability uh, that is an offering of the SAP BTP that allows application to uh, communicate with each other through asynchronous event and seamlessly extend their digital core. Uh, this is a message broker service, is fully managed service that runs on the cloud foundry environment of the SAP BTP, and it allows us to handle message as uh, required by the application. Uh, the simple architecture diagram below summarizes the main elements of the typical deployment and how they connect with each other. So here, uh, using this SAP enterprise messaging, we can create topics, we can create queues, and we can create webhooks so that the core ERP, as an example, can produce messages and applications subscribe to business relevant updates and react as required on their own pace. So queues can subscribe to topics and webhooks can subscribe to queues. So there can be multiple receivers of one piece of data. So uh, this uh, event mesh service supports uh, the standard messaging protocol like the HTTP REST, AMQP, MQTT, event messages used by core SAP systems like the SAP S4 HANA, SAP Marketing Cloud, and other SAP third-party application. They uh, comply with the open cloud event specification. So here I, I would be uh, talking about the uh, notification event feature of the enterprise event mesh. So if you look at this diagram, you know, there's a sales order on the right side, which is getting updated in the S4 HANA system. And uh, this creates a notification event. And if you look at the payload, it has uh, very few fields, you know, to indicate the update action and the sales order ID. And uh, you see that this event mesh is, uh, sorry, this event is sent to the event mesh and the consuming application receives this event. And based on the type of event which has been received, the consuming application might want some more information from the S4 HANA system. So there is a synchronous callback function uh, to the S4 HANA system via the SAP integration suite to obtain more attributes about that particular uh, sales order. So here, if you look at the entire thing, the notification event will contain minimal data and uh, uh, you know, this uh, uh, basically doesn't require the entire uh, order to be kind of, uh, you know, notified the first time when the notification is sent to the application who's registered uh, for that particular notification. So after this, I'll explain you the um, data event. So if you look at the um, picture around the data event originating from S4 HANA system, 
So we see on the right side that there's a business partner which is getting created in the SAP S4 HANA system. And this uh, change is creating a data event. And you notice the payload on the right side, it has much more fields than just the business partner ID. And this event is sent to the event mesh and the consuming applications, they receive the data. So in the data event, if you look at it, there is no additional call required and the full data set basically is delivered using the event mesh capability. So uh, coming to the uh, business impact of the event mesh, uh, we have uh, this B2B event mesh, which can support a wide range of digital application related use cases across lines of businesses, whether it is e-commerce, sales, finance, industries such as uh, energy, manufacturing, consumer goods, and retail services. And um, some of the business uh, scenarios are, it can automate end-to-end -end sale processes, real-time trading, IoT, and support fraud detection as well. So um, what is the business impact on of this um, entire enterprise messaging? Um, so uh, even mesh enables the events to flow between SAP and non-SAP application on-prem and in cloud dynamically and also in real time. So while if you look at the point-to-point -point communication, it is fine for sharing data between a limited number of senders and receivers, scalability there can become an issue. And SAP Event Mesh solves these issues and ensures messages can exchange reliably between the senders and multiple receivers at large scale. So there is this real-time communication, there's decoupled communication, we get performance improvement, it's highly scalable and distributed, cost-effective approach, and there's seamless connection, high responsiveness, and fault tolerance. So um, here I will be talking about, uh, you know, one of our case studies where we built an integrated uh, operation platform. And, uh, uh, you know, there were uh, very few uh, business objectives uh, given to us uh, when we started uh, working on this, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, particular uh, engagement. The customer was a petroleum and natural gas exploration company, which was headquartered in the U.S. And the challenge that they were facing was they... Um, we're gaining visibility into oil well operation and there was a lack of integration between various business processes running on uh, uh, disparate systems made it difficult for the customer to locate and collate information in a timely and efficient manner. And all this led to a significant delay in the processes and business decisions. So what we did was we built a platform with an objective to digitalize the key field operation and move the end-to-end -end process efficiency. So we built a digital the oil field, there were very few business objectives at that point in time, which was given to us, and we built it over a period of time, we improvised, we innovated. So there were three years, it was a complete three year transformation exercise, we went through it and we completely built on SAP BTP. So this IOP is a centralized cockpit where the company staff can manage operations, gain real time visibility into tasks and track sets accurately on a secure and multi cloud uh, infrastructure. So if you look at the uh, solution capabilities for the, uh, you know, the um, digital oil field solution that we provided, uh, we had a complete real time voice to action, augmented reality, robotic process automation, well master interface consolidation, machine learning insight to action, virtual assistant, plant maintenance app, cost analysis tool and application platform consolidation. And what we finally got was uh, we got a faster ROI. We reduced the total cost of ownership. We managed and operate by exceptions and we optimized the well operation and we improved the complete end-to-end -end process efficiency. Yeah, so if you look at this diagram, you know, we basically started this entire solution by, uh, you know, working on the digital field ticket. And then we moved on to digital oil run ticket and incident and investigation, well level profitability, plant maintenance, and other systems in the landscape. So this entire thing was basically around the event mesh. And this was, as I discussed earlier, it was done for a leading oil and gas company. And event mesh helped us build an architecture for our project. And there were events which were notified in real time so that the consumers could respond immediately uh, to the uh, events. Yeah, so uh, some of the things that uh, we used was the insight to action, touchless mobile, virtual reality, robotic process automation, machine learning models, augmented reality, and digital twins. So uh, this slide is about, you know, um, the day and life of a field operator, you know, since this entire solution was 
platforms, uh, you know, uh, for an integrated oil platform. So uh, if you look at the life of a field operator, you know, it is a field intensive task and uh, we made the entire thing touchless, you know. So this entire life cycle is around how he starts his day. So he creates an incident on his mobile and then they talk to the command center the remote task center approves the task that he has created, then he goes through it, there is a log, there is isolation, then there is remote assistant, which gives him the data from the command center. And uh, yeah, there is a location history, so that gives him uh, the location history, then he issues a work order, and there is a shift register, so that you know when the worker is moving out somewhere, someone else pitches in for him, and, and all this is recorded. So this entire uh, life cycle is basically the day and life of an operator using the interactive uh, integrated uh, operation platform and uh, uh, the event mesh played a key role in coming up with this entire solution. So with this complete solution, basically, uh, we have uh, you know, achieved 15% operation efficiency and 60% reduction in the process cycle time and uh, our ROI was realized in less than a year and it was an uh, improved user experience, optimized operation, mobile enablement for field operator. We have processed 15 million events uh, in the course of one year uh, with this solution using the enterprise event mesh. We harmonized the system landscape by integrating 15 plus business processes. There was real-time information from different IoT and systems and uh, improved collaboration between field operator and remote command center and digitalization of several manual processes, reducing the carbon footprint by eliminating uh, paper process work. So uh, this entire solution also won us the SAP Innovation Award in the year of 2019 and 2020. So we won uh, the award for uh, this uh, solution for a digital oil company. That is, uh, that is it from our side. And uh, we would be happy to answer any question that you have for us. Thank you so much. Thanks, Somya.